G'day, I'm Mozzie Mark and today I want to tell you about um, one of the very common mistakes a lot of beginners make and I've been watching a few drone videos lately, you may have even seen me mention that on the previous um, video that I posted. Watching other people's drones you get to see, uh, footage, you get to see some of the more common mistakes and one of them is um, when you're heading forward, which most certainly most new beginners tend to do, um, you want to adjust your direction just slightly so a little bit left a little bit right just so that you're going on the trajectory you want to be but the problem with that is um, that the automatic settings in uh, the DJI Go app for gains and exponential are set so that it's quite jerky so let me show you what I mean by that I've got my Phantom here today and I've got the exponentials set to 0.60 and I'm going to do a little bit of left and right hand turn so that you get to see what I'm talking about. So as you can see the turns were fairly jerky and if I change the expo as I've just done now to um, 0. 0. 0.30 then you're going to have much less movement of the drone for the same amount of input on the sticks. Let me show you how that looks on the actual phone and in the app, the DJI Go app. Oh and remember that when you write this in the DJI Go app it actually um, writes it onto the actual drone. So that means you can then turn off the DJI Go app if you're a Litchi fan and fly with Litchi as well and get that same exponential uh, change. Okay, so for those of you who don't know how to access the Expo settings in the DJI Go app, you just click on the top right hand corner there, um, that menu button, which brings up the general settings. Then go ahead and click on the drone icon at the top of the menu list here. Um, which brings up the MC settings. Scroll down, to, or actually you don't need to scroll, you can see it. Advanced settings is just there, click on that. And then you'll see EXP, stick filtering and gain. And for today's video we're just talking about the EXP, so you click on that one, and that brings up this screen. So as you can see, um, the one that I'm talking about is the rudder, uh, right rudder left, the center, one of those three images and I just flew with 0.6 now if you have a look when I move the stick to my right or left I'm going to write it, move it just a little bit to the um, left and it's already gone down a fair way and if I move it to the right it's already gone up a fair way as you can see so what that means is when you move a little bit to the right you're going to have a fair bit of movement of the drone and vice versa a little bit left and you, you move a fair bit to the left. So if I now change that by uh, inputting I can either click the 0 0.60 which I'll do now and that brings up this screen and you can simply change that to 0 0.3 which I, is what I'm flying with next and hit done and you can see it's actually changed. The other way to do that for those of you who don't know of course is simply click on that blue line and you can move it around as you can see. So now if I move my um, stick a little bit left you can see I get a very little downward so in other words very little movement happening initially so that's a handy tool so if you want to give it a little bit of input it won't automatically jerk to the left or the right a little bit of input and you get a little bit of turn a little bit of input on the right and you get a little bit of turn
Well, I think you'll agree that that was a much more smooth turn that you get. So do those adjustments on your expo and you'll find that you get a much better looking video. Now I know that some of you will know that already and, and that's great, I hope you do your adjustments to suit yourself. For those of you who don't, I hope that improves your video flying a little bit. As I said at the beginning, I'm Aussie Mark and thank you so much for watching my video. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I'd love to see you do that. And if you give me a like and a comment, that would really be appreciated. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye for now.